Look at that. An airship terminal on top of Empire State Building. Did you know? Now this is uh, an airship. Okay, a modern airship, Zeppelin. Now, we all remember that name, Zeppelin, from the Hindenburg disaster. So it was a Zeppelin, and this this happened a long, long time ago, right? Here we go, and look, you can see there's a tower there. Was it docked to that tower? Big airship, and we all know this story. So this was just promoted, promoted, promoted to say how dangerous these things were. So was that all a PSYOP, all this? To say, uh, airships, not can't use them anymore, sorry, they're deadly. One blew up. Because of this one event, airships stopped getting used. So why is that? And there are pictures of airships up on the Empire State Building. So we have these pictures. Okay, airships. Now look at this one. Okay, clearly this is tethered to the top of this building. This is a platform, this is a drop bridge, and people are walking into the airship from the top of the Empire State Building. And another interesting thing about this pic, see how they're walking inside into that? Because what always confused me with these airships was like the size of what's down here. Ah, the size now, of course, Goodyear, Goodyear, you know, <laughs> they sort of stole it, didn't they? So now it's a Goodyear blimp so instead of airships. But yeah, it's just this little bit underneath. I always thought that that was it and this was all a balloon. And I, and I thought that's pretty impractical, you know, to have this massive balloon and what do you fit in here, like 10 or 20 people. But yeah, definitely, you know, air balloons, uh, airships, sorry, were tethering to buildings. Here's another one. Uh, vanilla skies, are they, you know, we see so many vanilla skies, right? What is the deal there? Was the sky full of airships? But because they don't want us to use them, because they're dangerous, the Hindenburg, they all explode. Got to, you know, pay us money to fly across the world on our polluting airplanes. Have they all been blanked out? Ah, uh, so here we go. This is the top of the Empire State Building. Looks like a Vimana, doesn't it? Clearly, they're going inside this balloon. What does it say here? Passenger gangway. Okay, then they come off and they come down and this... Yeah, is I guess they go in and down the building. This is the... The airport. Uh, centering rope. So it just docks on here. Whoops. And up, up here you can see they tie the front on and it tethers to this big thing. Now, again, look where it's tethering. You know, how are these things powered, guys? How are they powered? Because we've seen this stuff coming out of the top of buildings, right? We know what, what the deal is with these spires. Blimp flirts with mooring mass, the top highest building. Ah, oh my gosh, that's what I want to see. Were these actually powering these machines? Let's have a look at this. Oh, yeah, baby. LZ Great Zeppelin. Okay, let's have a look. Are these, look at that, that's a floor. Uh, yeah, navigation. So that's where, you know, that's like the cockpit where the, where the driver sits. And we saw them walking on through the front here and look at this so even even if this was all on the top of this was all filled with gas as well if we just had this one level you know like I was saying I wonder if there's windows in there but that that's a lot of space you can imagine you've seen the size of these airships if these if the bottom of this whole airship was like this even if it was just one story high that's a lot of space you could get a lot of people in there 